Yo, what's good, YouTube? This is Rob Dollar Where the fuck I've been? I've been chilling, man. I've been really, really chilling. Um, I'm going to get into all of that and then, uh, you know, let you know, go over some shoes that are coming out and just chop it up with you guys. You know what I'm saying? Before I get into all that, make sure you guys hit that thumbs up. Say, yo, Dollars, we love what the fuck you doing. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. All right? <clears throat> Where I've been, i just been taking a break, man, you know what I'm saying, almost been a month since I dropped the video, I didn't even realize that to niggas hitting me up, like, yo, when you dropping a vid, when you dropping a vid, and I, I'm zoned out, like, you know what I'm saying, not paying no attention, I realized that, damn, it's almost been a month, so I was like, fuck it, let me tell everybody what's popping, uh, a couple of weeks ago, I, I started getting flagged again, I was like, man, fuck this shit, you know what I'm saying, I can't, it takes away... I love doing videos. I love chopping it up with you guys, but it just takes away my drive to do videos when I start getting flagged. You know what I'm saying? None of them stuck or nothing, but just the fact that people went to that extent to start flagging me. I like, man, fuck this YouTube shit. You feel me? <clears throat> Not you guys, just the, the haters that are up here. Like, there's a whole bunch of haters smiling your face, slick hating ass niggas, and then they just go flag you. For no reason, you know what I'm saying? I don't fuck with nobody. I stay in my own lane, but then you got the fuck niggas out there that want to do dumb, corny shit. You feel me? So I like, man, fuck it. it. It just takes, it deflates me, man. Like the fucking footballs in the AFC Championship game. It just deflates me. Like I just don't have the motivation. And then you got people on Twitter that talk about, oh, people don't take YouTube serious. Their video quality is this and blah, blah, blah. They don't switch it up. You can't. Why would I take time out of my day to do all of that, buy a $1,500, $2,000 camera, do all this fancy shenanigans shit, and then lose everything, you stupid bastard? And you, like I said, you got these people that actually sit on Twitter really talking about people making videos and how they make them. My nigga, when you could wake, when I, if I'm going to invest five hours of of videos, editing, and cutting, and chopping, and putting music, and making it all fancy, I want my work to be there, not to wake up one day, and all my work is gone, all that time I invested is gone, and then YouTube barely pays you for videos, what the fuck do I look like, an idiot, I'm about math, I'm about paper, like, if it ain't even and out, why would I waste my time on that, when YouTube could simply say, oh, this shit is, is, is not right on your channel, we're gonna erase your whole channel, fuck that, man, I'm not wasting my time. If you want to do that, if you want to, if you want to get your fan base going because you dead, because you a fraud, then that's what you got to do. I don't have to do that. I always keep it real with my viewers. We chop it up. I always kept it real. My videos ain't the best, but I keep it a hundred. I show you what you need to show. Uh, need to what need to see. I tell you what you need to know. I'm not gonna sugarcoat nothing. You feel me? So that's basically what it is. I got flagged. None of it stuck. But just the fact that it went back to that bullshit, niggas hating, I just said, man, fuck it, I need a break from this shit. You know, I love you guys to death, but I just, I can't do the, I can't do the hating, the slick hating shit, the sideline bullshit, the niggas on Twitter talking about people videos ain't like they used to be, the quality, the content. Nigga, eat a dick, my nigga. When you can wake up and all this shit be gone and you invested all your time in it, hey, that's you, that's on you. I'm going to do my videos how I do them. If you don't like them, don't watch them. Get off my dick. You feel me? And it's crazy because it's the ones that talk the most shit that's supposedly not supporting this type of shit. They be the main ones watching, looking, hitting the dislikes. But you still giving me my views. So I appreciate you stopping by. You dig what I'm saying? But that's what it is. I'm trying to go over some shoes. I'm going to do a review later. You know what I'm saying? I know you guys seen this shit. The Yeezys. I, I guess they're going to be showing them soon. During the all, I don't know if they releasing during the All Star weekend, or if they just gonna show them. But you know, I posted it on Instagram, and if you if you follow me on Instagram and Twitter, you see me go ham. Like I'm still the same nigga. You dig what I'm saying? I'm just not making videos as consistent because they keep doing the fuck boy shit, and I ain't got time for that, man. Like I said, people invest their time to do this shit, and then you can wake up and all that shit is gone, man. I ain't got time for none of that corny shit, man. You feel me? But yeah, man. Comment down below, let me know how you feel about the Yeezys. Comment down below and let me know how you feel about me taking this break because of the ignorant stuff. Let me know how you feel about motherfuckers saying people video quality and content ain't the same. It's just you go to Twitter and, and copy something from your screen and blah, blah, blah. But not realizing that those same people lost channels 
that they've invested hours of time. You get nothing in return. Five, ten dollars from YouTube. Come on, my niggas. Be real. Let's be real. You feel me? But anyway, man, let me know how you feel about that. Comment down below, man. Let me know how you feel about these easy threes. I haven't seen no leaked footage, no no leaked photos or nothing. Soon as I get them, I'll post them up on my IG. Talk about them on Twitter, whatever. You feel me? Let me know how you feel about these. Some motherfucking old red 13s. I don't know, man. They all right. You feel me? That red shit all right. You feel me? I don't like that. It's kind of too dark, but you know. They all right, yo. It's a 13. I like 13s, man. I don't like the way they made the right here, how they made the toe box real flat. That shit kind of hurt my toes, but you know, comment down below. Let me know how you feel about these. And let me know if you following um following me on Instagram and Twitter, man. If you don't, make sure you follow me. All my all my information gonna be in the description. A few pickups I got, you know what I'm saying? Something light. You know, I'm gonna give you guys an early look at these right here. The black Oreos. We're gonna go over those together. And uh, yeah, man, that's the reason why I took a break, you know. Then I don't like dealing with the foolery, the ignorance, and nothing like that, so. I just stepped off away for a little while. I took a little break. You feel me? But comment down below. Let me know how you feel about the situation. Let me know how you guys feel about the Super Bowl. Man, comment down below. Just let's chop it up. You dig what I'm saying? You guys know I try my hardest to get back to everybody's comments. I try, but Tom, you know, we all got lives that we live outside of YouTube. But uh, yeah, man, let's talk. Chop it up. Man, tell me, man, did y'all miss me? Did y'all motherfuckers miss me? Yeah, I know y'all did, but yeah, I missed y'all too. But uh, anyway, man, like, comment, and subscribe. This is Rob Dollar. Get the fuck out of here, y'all.